I've been adjusting this camera for maybe 15 minutes now. I can get it to the right angle that I want. Come oh, on, man, help me out here. It's too hot in this office. Is that better? No, it's not. I guess my vlogs always start with this one because I'm an oily girl. So today's vlog is about Marie Kondo and the Kon Marie method. Method. I just wanted to introduce her to you guys because I think she is a really interesting character. Her hiding method is really interesting as well. I don't know a lot about her. I still need to do some research. So why don't we learn together? Let's go. So for you who doesn't know Marie Kondo, she is a very famous Japanese. What is she called again? An organizing consultant. And what she does is she teaches people how to organize their stuff around the house, tidy up things. I didn't even know that this is a thing, but I guess people really need to learn how to organize things. She has already written four books about tidying up and organizing. I mean, I guess I'm a little bit skeptic of what she do because I feel like that's like natural to I guess I can speak for myself because I mean look at this office space right now it's so messy I guess I'm just a little bit skeptic because she's like taking organizing into like a whole new level and like putting associating all these different meanings with it I'm always skeptic about those stuff why would you have to do that one of her core messages is that uh, the things that you own should spark joy I think that's really beautiful if you if you put it like that, but I'm not sure I, I don't know what to think of her right now. It's really interesting. I mean, there's nothing bad about it I mean, it's just tidying up and organizing things if you package it in that way And then maybe people will be more keen to organize their stuff if you put more meaning into why you have to organize and tidy up your space. I guess people will do that more than just you have to tidy up because you have to tidy up. She just released her Netflix. It's a Netflix series. It's called Tidying Up with Marie Kondo. It's blowing up in the US. She's a really big thing in the internet. There's a huge surge of donated items into thrift stores because of the KonMari method. People are starting to tidy up their houses and getting rid of the items that does not spark joy for them. That's really interesting. I mean, people are actually doing this. I, I have just watched a video of her folding clothes. Like the most basic of things, folding clothes. She does it in like very graceful I didn't know folding clothes could be turned into like an art or something when she folds clothes the clothes stand you have to watch it I kind of tried to react on it because it's the weirdest thing that I've seen I am going to demonstrate how to fold clothes. The key point here is to feel the piece of clothing with your hand and communicate your affection through your palm. That's On what I do. With the That's how you fold clothes. How is this any different? Okay. Then fold it in half. When a piece of clothing is folded correctly, it will stand. What? Oh my gosh. And it stands? That's fast. Et voila, it stands up. Let's Sucks. fold socks. No. What? I will. I don't understand how it stands. I guess I have to try that out myself and see if I can make clothes stand. I'm not trying to bash her or anything. I'm really interested in what she does because I could really use some help with tidying and organizing stuff. If I will zoom out and you will see this place, this does not look cute at all. Maybe I should try her folding method. It's very weird because she tells you to like feel the clothing. So weird. But it's interesting, but it's weird. So I'm, I'm really into it. <laughs> we have some clothes that are, are hanging back there that needs to be folded up. So I guess this is the perfect time to see how well I can compare. Yeah, let's go do that. Kind of. Oh my gosh, that is so bright. I'm so sorry about that. Let me fix that for you. Like this. This is like sando for babies. If Marie Kondo folds it, it will stand on its own. I'm getting chills just talking about it. We will get a variety of items 
So I'm getting this one. We, we should also get colored ones. I'm getting this one. I'll try to fold a bigger... Ooh, we should get this one. This is a really interesting... What else? What else? This one. I think this one is fitting because this is a unique law. And it's the Japanese brand. And Marie Kondo is Japanese. So, you know, connections. Ooh, I think we should get like a very easy one. Like a towel. So I think I've gathered a pretty solid lineup of clothes. <laughs> So let's go. Okay. Do I think this is a challenge? I think the challenge here is to try to make the piece of clothing stand on its own like Marie does. I don't think I can do that. We are starting with this piece. Okay. A very cute outfit. I mean, you could pair it with a lot of things. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, you have to feel the piece of clothing. I just have to make it like, um, like that. And she does this like weird thing with her hand, like she karate chops the... Like that. <gasps> Wait, it's standing on its own! She's legit. Her stuff is legit. Like, I'm so proud of myself. And look at that! I have channeled my inner Marie Kondo, so I'm just gonna do it uh, freestyle for now without her guiding help. <laughs> Feel the clothing. You need to respect it and communicate with it properly. This really feels ridiculous. So she slides it like that. What is happening here? I've never done this, I swear. Okay, 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 okay. Oh! Oh! Okay, so I guess it expires. Of course, it will not stand forever. I know that. But still, it stands. Can I do it? Can I can I make it stand? I guess it loses its power once it can. Mm, that's better. You have to fold calmly, gracefully. Like that. Okay. You have to stand, buddy. You have to stand. Make your mama proud. Mm. I have three achievements right now. Is this how she folds it? I don't know how she folds like the sleeve. And then you have to feel it again. Respect, respect. Make it as flat as you can. In Uniqlo, do they use the Marie Kondo folding method? That's what I want to know. Wait, this is heavy. I don't know if this will work. The Marie Kondo method is legit. I mean, you have to try this at home. You try it out for yourself because it's really it's a whole new experience. Oh, this is a harder one. It's so soft. It's so flowy. This is the true test. It's not gonna. It's not gonna stop. I don't think it will. Marie Kondo, you you're doing a good job of spreading the message of organization and the message of you guys have to tidy up your spaces. You're doing something good in the world and I appreciate you for that. Oh yeah, that's it for the vlog today. Also, a quick reminder, uh, we have seven days left for the YouTube dance contest. Please, please, please prepare your dance routines and film yourselves. If you, have, if you want to edit them, of course you can do that. And then submit it to us because we are really waiting for your entries. So I guess that's it for the vlog today. Thank you guys for watching and see you again tomorrow. Goodbye!